Speak your piece. Keep your eyes open. Oh, are you headed out? At the Titan's command, we keepers began the acclamation. Each installation, all linked to the manifold, produced vast numbers of Titan-forged workers. We fired the great forges to fuel the acclamation and empower the manifold to heal the ravaged world. Then began construction of the Corway, a direct channel to the heart of Azeroth that would allow the Titans to study the world's soul without harming it. However, as we delved deeper, we encountered certain obstacles, colossal crystals, which we came to realize were calcified chunks of the world soul's essence. They are of great power, and I wonder how many yet remain undiscovered beneath the earth, all over the world. By word of the great Khazgaroth, the Titan's research has revealed that Azeroth's world soul is indeed the prime. Our purpose may yet be fulfilled. Enormous, powerful chunks of world soul essence. Do you think Belladar and Halifall could be one of them? Potentially. But it was never within the scope of our edicts to study the crystal. He mentions the Titan Forge making the Corway. Did you know it was built to study the world soul? We were created for the great purpose of serving the Titans, and thus we built it. Its purpose was irrelevant to us. We fulfilled our edicts dependably, and we have strived to do so throughout the millennia. Despite Kaz Algar facing many... setbacks. Setbacks? What do you mean? Long ago, the continents of the world split apart, and the machinery that powered our facility was damaged, cut off from the manifold. We were unable to repair the connection. We operated on auxiliary power for a time, but eventually it ran out, and we fell into disarray. That must have been the sundering. It's miraculous that any of this survived intact. You have my focus.